All right, if you're looking for something fun for the whole family to do tomorrow, then how about some live music, some bacon eating, bacon eating contests, games, activities, and that sound pretty good to you? Well, this is all going to be happening at Bacon Fest. And here with me now is Dean Strober from Blue River. Solutions Productions, I should say. Right. Uh, good morning. Right. Good morning, Kristen. Thank you so much for coming in and bringing me some food. Bacon. Uh, we've got a lot of bacon here. We've got some yeah. incredible, and this is a, a sample, just a really small sample of everything that's going to be at the festival. Oh, I can only imagine. I mean, these incredible uh, pinon uh, vanilla cupcakes from Cake Fetish. Everything's covered in bacon. They've got a vanilla and blueberry cupcake covered in bacon, bacon donuts, bacon chocolate, bacon ice cream. Uh, Brenda's Brittle wow. is coming out with some incredible bacon brittle for it. Mm -hmm. um, and. Just all kinds, of everything Incredible. you can imagine with bacon. Sweets with bacon, yes. salty with bacon. You yes. can get, you can get your fix. It sounds like a bacon fest. First yes. year here yes. in Albuquerque. Uh, why should people go tomorrow? Other than to enjoy and well, indulge. <laughs> it's really to, to, it's a showcase for local chefs and restaurants. I mean, it's everything from the restaurants, the food trucks, the breweries, the catering companies, candy shops, coffee shops. Everybody is creating something unique that mm -hmm. you usually can't get from them elsewhere in other times of the year with bacon. And plus, you get to uh, also sample some of the favorite chefs from around the area yes. too, because they're going to be bringing out their best bacon dishes yes. to this event. And it's not too expensive either. No, right? it's a seven dollar ticket for adults. Mm -hmm. Kids four to twelve are only two dollars. That includes admission to the balloon museum. Oh, so, and okay. all the food, the, all the vendors, they'll be selling their bacon bites for three dollars okay. or less. Oh, and fantastic! And so it's incredibly affordable. It's a lot of fun. We have seven bands, DJ. We have uh, bacon, free bacon games to win bacon and bacon prizes. We have mm -hmm. bacon eating contests, bacon cooking demos from the Santa Fe Culinary Academy. It's a fun day. It's a fun day. I can tell you right now, the weather is going to be spectacular for it <laughs> tomorrow. So we got some good sizzle. stuff coming there. No, <laughs> oh no, that would be a really, really bad thing. <laughs> okay, so now you brought something fun for me to do. We're going to do some yes. bacon dipping. We're going to dip some bacon okay. in chocolate. I know some of the purists, ah, but it's really, really fantastic. Okay. okay, so And how, so how? real quickly, what I've done is, it's a combination of everything I love. I've okay. created some coffee marinated bacon. Coffee okay, so this bacon. has been okay. this is a thick cut bacon that's been marinated in coffee for a few hours. A nice dark coffee, like a Villa Miriam uh, or something really dark and beautiful. That and sounds good, actually. It's beautiful. You throw this in the oven for about 15, 20 minutes. It really depends on the thick and the cutness, the cut of the, the bacon. Okay. And you want it to get nice and dry and crunchy. Okay. Okay. And, okay. And you also want to, you don't want to do it on the on the grill top. You want to do it in in a pan. In a pan, just like this. Exactly. In the oven. So all the grease comes off. And when okay. you're done with that, your this result is what you have. will be some beautiful, really crispy. Really I like the crispy, crispy bacon. bacon. Exactly. Okay. So, so this sounds like it'd be good on, on its own. It is. It is. Yes, you can. Okay. Of course. I'm no, no, cheating. no, no. All right. Go ahead. So, 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 so now what happens? So then okay. you, you fight the urge to eat it. Okay. Yeah. Because when you see it, you do want to eat it. That's where you make more than you need. Okay. Then you grab some tongs. Okay. Oops, I did that wrong. Here. I'll put this one to the side. Yes. I'll so the chocolate hot. So and okay. when you're melting chocolate, mm -hmm. um, I always use a double boiler method, which is one pot of hot water, okay. not boiling but pretty hot, and then you put the chocolate in a smaller pot on top of that one within okay. that, and that's going to give you a beautiful melted chocolate. Ooh, nice. So now you just Did dip you that in there. Okay, yep, so dip can, it in you there. You can actually drop it in there and then pick it back up. All right, here, I'll like. just do it like that. Okay. It's going to be kind of, and then now what and I do you're going to place on that on, right on the parchment paper. Okay. Parchment paper, which is incredible stuff. Nothing will stick on that. And then, oh, okay. for finishing touch, I always suggest a little pinch of just some just sea salt. Oh, salt. Sea salt, oh, yep. so you get the whole salty, sweet exactly. thing going Exactly. It here. reminds the bacon while it's there, why, oh, why it's there. Okay. And then you let that cool in the fridge for about half an hour. And the result is what you get. Is okay, something so you, beautiful. Obviously, like that. You need to dunk it a little bit more than what I did. Yeah. Oh, that looks awesome. Yeah. Go right. Please do. Go right ahead. Mm, first time. Wow. Yeah. I like it. Yeah. I didn't think I'd like it. <laughs> I like it. All right. Very cool. Again, information. All on our website, casa.com. Yes. 10 to 6 tomorrow, Balloon Fiesta. Be there. It's at the, just the, it's at the Balloon Museum. Balloon Museum. Yep. I'm sorry. Yep. Yeah, Balloon Museum. Balloon so Museum? get there. We have exactly. the information on our website, too. Yes. And dive in, dig in on And all the information is at abqbacon.com. Okay. Yeah. Thank you so much. We'll be right back with weather.